everybody. So this is your friend Arun from Live in Germany channel. So today I'm going to give a very interesting video, especially for students who are willing to come to Germany. So I came across uh, Manuel Dotel, who's like founder of uh, the products Quicker through one of our subscribers, Aditya. So thanks to him. So today he will be talking about like about how a person can use this particular web app or software to apply and come to Germany. And also he will walk us through the process. So I hope this is very informative for you guys. So please watch till the end. Now I give the table to Manuel Dotel. Please. Arun, thank you very much for being here. It's a pleasure being on your channel. Hey everyone, welcome. I am Manuel. Um, I'm the founder of Squicker. We are a social startup from Germany helping Indian students to study in Germany. Uh, what we noticed in the past is for you, there's two possibilities. Either um, you choose a consultant, which can be very expensive, or sometimes not really reliable, or second, you invest a lot of time in the process. In, in getting okay which university should you go how does the process look like and what i've done in the past is when i studied i helped students from time to time international students mostly and then i came across them okay they also need help during the application process so we built a little tool for that we, we're doing a lot of webinars and but that's not that was not that was helpful totally but it was not a quick introductory tool where you can see the whole process. So we, we decided to build something for you, which enables you to, see, to not, not have to do like three months of research, but I have a 15 minutes, a deep dive, and you can go step by step through um, the entire process. So you won't need a consultant anymore, or you don't need to invest a month of uh, research. Mm -hmm. would like to share this tool real quick. Um, Give me a second. Yeah, that's the tool. Our name is Squicker. So it's a mix of simple and quicker because that's basically what we want to achieve. So if, if you go to this website, you will see a link right here, sign up here. You can easily just, it, it, it's then this tool where you can just create an account. And you're being welcomed. And in this tool, it's going chapter by chapter, going through the entire process. And we start with the basics, especially like in every every chapter, we have a webinar telling, okay, inviting you to um, join. We have always a student from Germany who went through the process, who knows the entire, who know the entire details, and will be explaining about his um, about his experiences. In every chapter, we have certain documents prepared like for example the most common questions about studying in germany um financing yourself how much money do you need how much does an apartment cost how much money do you need for this tuition fees and so on so everything is prepared for an entire chapter and if you have decided okay yeah i'm interested i want to i want to continue then um yeah every chapter is basically the same we have articles prepared about the specific chapter in this case how to select the course, how to select the university, what to look out for, is the ranking important, um, how should I choose a course, and also we have included a little tool, because we noticed um, that or the university websites, sometimes a little time intensive or frustrating, so what we did was, um, yeah, you just type in what kind of CGPA you have, let's say in this case, an eight, um, and you have a background of mechanical engineering and you're interested in automotive or um, mechanical engineering and um, you want to know okay which universities ex exist immediately and then we'll be, okay yeah there's a lot of universities available like for example um, at the University of Hamburg let's see okay you see the specific requirements you see the deadline immediately and you see what kind of documents are required and then you take this information and proceed and we show you exactly, okay, how do you need to prepare your application? Again, a very- One question, Manuel, sorry to interrupt you again. Sure. So uh, in the previous process in step four, you showed regarding like when people enter, uh, like they can right now, say for example, if someone is in third year of studies and the last year they can improve their grades. So just by assuming, okay, now I have uh, 8.1 and maybe if I put some effort and improve my score, I could get 8.5 and that uh, search tool which you showed could tell them 
what will be the difference when their score remains the same and also when the score improves in future for example like for student upcoming uh, students who are uh, preparing for it during the third and fourth year of studies especially like yeah. that yeah so grades are always important of course like grades are very important uh, besides the letter of motivation for example but 80% of the university don't have a specific requirement of grades mm -hmm. they just usually they said well like those who have they have a requirement of like 2.3 for example which is a 63 roughly cgpa mm -hmm. then if you apply um they like if you if you have a grade lower like 6% for example you can't apply anymore but it does not mean that with a 63 you are um accepted you're being accepted mm -hmm. uh, and grade of course the better your chances are mm -hmm. but because mostly universities say okay just apply to us we will review your grades we will review your application and then we make a decision based on it so this tool is built on what the universities require at the minimum mm -hmm. uh, have no grade required um, then it will have no effect on what you have okay. but of course like in the final decision making grades are important of course okay perfect no i just wanted to know uh, that your tool kinds of also helps to filter out for candidates based on <laughs> cgpas especially and if some university it does. requirement it also shows in here right it does it does actually um what filters most is basically um, because very often universities require a certain um, bachelor in a certain field. Mm -hmm. Like for example, if you want to do a, um, a master in artificial intelligence, mm -hmm. very often they require a bachelor in computer science. Mm -hmm. and, and while a lot of students with a mechanical engineering background want to do artificial intelligence, mm -hmm. that's not enough for the university. Mm -hmm. So you click here, okay, what subject you currently study and which one you are interested in and they look for cross fields basically in which field you you can with your current studies you can study them basically in the future okay okay i think that's a very important point for those who are uh, looking at the first time this makes the process simplifying yeah it simplifies the process okay please continue then yeah yeah absolutely absolutely right because when you when you do mechanical engineering and you're interested in computer science for example mm -hmm. you need to every single university website mm -hmm. just saying uh, uh, like rejection over and over again mm -hmm. and here you can see it immediately and you can once you 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 are eligible I, I think that's a very good uh, feature yeah yeah absolutely and then you see here okay applying at the university and it's always the same it's always a, a short document we have included um past webinars mm -hmm. Um, you can you can attend our future webinars. You can join our past webinars, and we explain quickly. Okay, um, how does it work? Um, we have a little task for you, for example. Mm -hmm. um, deadlines, check the admission criteria, so you know exactly what you need to do. Some mm -hmm. pictures included, the, the, the costs included, and then after reading this document, you know exactly how to proceed. Mm -hmm. And if you have more questions, you can always join the community where we have several thousand people already, and they can. Uh, answer questions so i think after when you read those documents carefully it will take you maybe take uh, 15 to 20 minutes mm -hmm. that's a really really great idea and you ha don't have to research for months mm -hmm. through different websites um, but you can do it quickly you can get an easy introduction you can ask people in the community you can attend webinars and then um, there's basically no more need mm -hmm. to hire an expensive consultant in the end actually okay 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 no i, I think it's a pretty uh, straightforward process which you have showed us yeah and uh, uh thanks for the quick demo i would also say so uh, do you want to add something to this like what else does quicker offer for students especially yes so basically what we do um what we don't offer obviously here but what we do um is to to help internet like help indian students to not give up early because what i've seen in the past is okay yeah consultant is expensive or i don't want to invest a month of my time into into this research process so there's a lot of people who have not applied who actually could apply mm -hmm. uh, have like concerns that they're great or not good enough who are afraid that they don't have enough money for example so they don't apply while other people um have applied and they got a, they got an admission mm -hmm. other people not applied because they were too afraid they would not do it for some reason mm -hmm. and with this 
um, process, we enable everyone that it is totally achievable and we encourage everyone to just do it and try, even if you think, hey, you have low grades. Mm -hmm. Usually it's not true. There's always a way, to be honest. Perfect. I mean, you, you are right. You are right. I mean, this will be a much quicker way and then easier for them to identify where they can actually apply. And this was pretty good. Like, like all of you. Um, yes. Thank you very much. Nice. So uh, I think uh, this was a very good demo from you, uh, Syed Manuel. And also, I, we also had feedback from Aditya that he had tested the tool and it was pretty nice. So I'll also try to get his feedback. I'm sure he'll be watching this video. And uh, so for those who are watching this, guys, you can apply without a consultant's help, help yourself using such a tool which Manuel has created. And uh, please do try the tool, test the app and use it. And also uh, suggest it to your friends. If you're on third year of studies, like want to prepare for Germany, this could give you a very good overview and you can continue using this tool for you to apply. So this will yes. don't have to search for a consultant online always to apply. Like when I applied, I also had this difficulty and that's also a reason why I found this app really useful. So my personal story, I, I told to Manuel, like I applied to a consultant back in 2011 and then he didn't apply. Basically, I was left to apply myself later and it was a very bad time. So something like this, you can plan early and this will be really helpful. So again, I thanks Manuel for the time he has taken to give a short demo. And if you have any further question, guys, please to put in our comment section. Also, you can join us Telegram. We have a Telegram, so I'll also try to add Manuel to our group. So he would be happy to help, I guess. Yeah. Yes. Perfect. Thanks a lot. Um, thanks for giving us a chance to be here. And hopefully it's really helpful for a lot of people in the future. Thanks. Thanks, Manuel. Yeah. Then um, see you soon. Yeah. Take care. Thanks. See you soon.